Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger Part 71. We've got our group, Frog, Magus, and Luca. And we're gonna start off on one of the side quests because we are in the Faded Hour. There are several side quests that need to be done that we talked about in the last bit. This one that we're going to start off with requires us to go to 600 AD. So, full speed ahead. Hi-ho, epic! Away! Alright, so, now that we have a flying epic, we have access to an area that we didn't have access to before. We actually have access to several areas. Now, we remember this place, and as you see here, there's something else new here. Uh, there's a sinkhole in the desert, but that is going to be for another time. And up here we have the remnants of where Magus's castle used to be. And there's another little place popping up here. That's Ozzy's Fort. That's another one that we'll be dealing with in a little bit. As is this place. There's just lots of new stuff that we have access to. The place that we want to go to now is this place, which was previously unreachable. This is the village of Chorus. And up here is the Northern Ruins. We go to the Northern Ruins, let's look around. The place is falling apart, as you can see, there's holes everywhere. There's knights. Now, like anything else in 600 AD, this stuff is all pretty physical resistant. Which is why I brought Luca and Magus. 325 points of damage. Holy crap. That hurt. Oh! MP Buster steals MP. And they only get to do it once. 16 tech points, full ether, frog levels up, Magus levels up, dual tech line bomb. Nice. Alright. <clears throat> so, looking around more sentries. Killing these sentries actually really doesn't do anything. We just need to look around. Uh, don't worry about the, uh, the treasure chests. We're not going to be getting any of them. Would you stop trying to kill Magus? Granted, that's not gonna do anything. They're gonna... Oh, holy crap, they're still alive. Would you stop with Magus? Alright, so... Physical resistant... And would you stop, you little bastards? God, I can't wait till I learn, uh... Flare. Alright, now you should be dead. No! Die! Damn you all. There we go. Thankfully, they finally died. And now I'm not gonna make that mistake again, and we're gonna give Magus an ether. Alright, so yeah, don't open the treasure chest, and we can't get into the door because there's a hole there. But this is all for a reason. Uh, son of a bitch. I hate this. I, 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 I hate this. Alright. Fire two. Fire two. Everything must die. Grudge, yeah, I don't care. Wow, they re just... We're gonna mess Magus up hardcore, is what we're gonna do. But, look at the tech points. Look at the XP. That's... That's well worth it. And this just shows you the kind of stuff we're going to be going in. So I pressed the wrong button. I didn't want to go into the party swap. I wanted to go into the menu. 
So, yeah, it's... It's kind of a big thing now, is there's going to be things that are going to rip us apart. That's why they give us these subquests. Alright, so... Cure 2... Magus? And give him... Another one. Granted, I probably could have gotten by with just using regular ether, because he's only going to get enough MP to use it once before they use an MP buster on him again. Alright, so we've gone that way. Let's go up this way. See what's going on. Can't do anything here. So, we have effectively looked all over the ruins. Now, what you want to do is, once we get... Uh, go talk to the cafe. We're going to talk to the building. We're going to go talk to the people in the cafe, is what I meant to say. My tools have been stolen. I can't get any work done now. Alright, that's kind of important. This is also kind of important, too. This is our good friend Toma, who somehow got over here without a flying machine. I think there's the... the port. Yes, the port. So this is going to involve going back and forth a lot from the present to the Middle Ages to the present to the Middle Ages to the present to the Middle Ages. So once it loads up, there's a grave over there that we need to go to as well later. Lots of stuff that's, like I said, lots of stuff that's popped up. It's awesome. Granted, the game only now just gives you the ability to uh, open up with free roaming. Alright, there is a giant knight here who's now blocking our path. Grr. And it gives boss fight. Uh, this boss, yeah, it's not really a boss fight. It's Cyrus. Holy crap. Um, I'm going to have Frog attack him. Miss. So, obviously we can't do anything to him. We use Mega Bomb. I don't know if that counts or not. Zero. Mega Bomb of Death. It's like Napalm on steroids. Alright, so, as you can see, we can't really do anything to him. So, there's no point in trying to do things to him. But I'm going to show off Dark Bomb, because I don't think we've used that yet. Dark Bomb's actually one of my favorite abilities. Just because it looks cool. Alright, so, yeah, no sense in wasting what we can't do. Because the fight ends at some point anyway, once we realize who it is. My sword hath no effect. Lin. No, my name's not Lin. Gul. Oh, he's trying to say Glen. What? 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 Alright, so if we try to talk to him again, we'll just have to fight him again. So, yeah. Now we've learned that the ruins in the past is filled with bad guys. The carpenter has no tools. So, we've got to find tools in order to get them to work. This guy is addicted to soda. I mean, alcohol. You want to borrow my tools? Be my guest. I'm busy here, so get them from my wife. So let's go get the tools from his wife. And she lives... None of them. Is it the mayor's mouse or the residence? Mayor's mouse. Haha. -ha. Mickey Mouse has had his effect on me. Anyway. My husband's never on. I'm going to show him his ball. Okay, so she's going to beat her husband to death. Thankfully, she gives us his tools beforehand, because let's, let's face it, she seems like the type who'd take the hammer to him. 
We got one tools. <laughs> Wait a second. Grammatically, that doesn't make any sense. It should be one tool set, one set of tools, or one tool. Alright, now that I'm done complaining about the like one of the translation errors in this game, there's not too many, um, other than the soda that's actually beer. I'm drinking orange juice. Now it's apple juice. Now it's beer. Yay, beer. Alright, so we've got tools. Let's go talk to the dude in the cafe. Hey, now you've got tools. Stop being such a slack ass. Go build something. You've got some tools there. You lend them to a buddy? I'll lend you my tool. My one tools. Alright, so he goes to get to work, and we. I think we gotta go to his house first. Obviously, the carpenter lives in the same house for the next 400 years. That's what I call job security. Thanks for lending me those tools. Now I can finally get to work. I guess I'll start with the ruins. Come on, you lazy blokes. And his four cloned workers head to the ruins. And so what we want to do is head to the ruins. Because in the time it takes us to walk there, they've done what fixing they can do. Obviously, they work fast. We're done for now. We can't repair spots where monsters hide. Call us after you get rid of them. Now, we've already gotten rid of the monsters. He's just lazy. He, he really is just lazy. And so now we can walk up this way. And there are going to be more monsters that show up. And that's what I'm going to go ahead and get rid of mostly in this one. Is bad guys. More bad guys. These guys I don't have, think have MP Buster, so I'm not as worried about them ripping me apart. And the whole reason why I brought uh, Luke and Magus is because they both have access to fire, and as you can see, fire is exceptionally useful against these things. The only problem is, Magus's fire is considerably more useful, which makes him kind of a target. But, they still die fairly quickly. 15, 10 XP, 24... We get a fair bit of money off of this, but um, don't think that we're going to get to keep it. Um, I'm going to use another ether, and then I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. And then the next part will be more uh, killing of bad guys. More ethers. More ethers going on. Okay. So yeah, um, I'll go ahead and end the video here, and I will see you all in our next installment, in which we kill more undead things. Till then, later everyone.